Dustin with Dream Cab Customs. Um, we're back here with Steve Sierra's 1980 CJ7. Finished installing the uh, 39001 uh, two-barrel throttle body from Phytech. Uh, just doing a little update video. We posted one here a while back, if you guys saw that. We finally got this thing mounted. Um, we had to do a little spacer on the air cleaner housing to get it raised up and did an adapter here to go uh, from the original uh, carburetor over to the new throttle body. It's got a bigger base on it. Uh, we had to do a little fab work on the mounting bracket, the adapter for the throttle body. It seemed to work out pretty good. That was from Speedway Motors, but the holes were just a little off from the machining, I believe. So we fixed that and got it going. Um, the throttle linkage hooked right up just like it should uh, with the factory bracket there from Phytech. It worked pretty well. It actuates just like it's supposed to. Everything came out pretty nice on it. Um, as always with the uh, electric frame mounted fuel pumps, we did have a little bit of an issue with noise from the vibration um, through the metal. This thing has no insulation inside, so it was a little loud in there. Uh, we took care of that. We uh, rubber mounted that thing. We used some grommets through the mounting surface on the vehicle and also some mounting bra rubber grommets on the mounting bracket for the fuel pump. Um, put some rubber bushings between that and it seemed to work out pretty well. It's uh, I'd say 90% quieter than it was. Turn the key on so you can get a little listen on it. There you go, it's pretty quiet. Starts up really well. It'll drop down to about 750 RPM once it's warmed up. It's pretty cold right now, we just backed it out of the shop. But as you can tell, as we walk around in the back here, the sound is pretty limited compared to what they are usually with the, uh, the rubber isolator that Phytech gives us. Um, I'm going to talk to the rep on that and see if we can come up with something a little bit different for mounting. But everything seems to be alright. I think Steve's going to be real happy with it. We did a lot of work. It was kind of a snowball effect with this thing. Had quite a few problems as, uh, as the process went through concerning the, the clutch that we did and some uh, rip engine mounts and a few other items but it's running pretty good we're happy with it it runs all right for having almost a hundred thousand on it but our ac is dropping it's not completely warm it's only 130 degrees as of now so that'll drop down it's already below 10. we're idling at about 750 average 14 AFR. Just another good build that we did. It went together really well. A uh, little custom work getting the, the two barrel, like I said, adapted to this thing, but we're happy we're able to get it done for the customer. He's gonna be happy when he sees it. All right, thanks guys, stay tuned. We'll have some more videos and some other uh, rigs going down the road. All right, thank you.